premises. But don't you know, I was assaulted by a constable in here. No, the cops right here. So I've been trying to get my report on this Walgreens. And here go to the cops. I'm about to open the cigarettes. See no gun? Holding it with my phone. How y'all doing, sir? 1531. Hey, officer. How you doing, Officer Smith? Hey, you can come over here, Mr. Constable. Where you going? I need to talk to you, sir. I need a report. Where you going at, cops? Pussies? Told you, y'all ain't shit. I came to come talk to you. The fuck you running at, bitch? Yeah. Oh, you lucky the kid did. Fuck. Excuse my language. Yeah, you ain't do nothing to me. It was the other, it was the other council bull, the bald head tall guy. That's all. And I've been trying to get the information so I can write them up. Okay. So. I mean, what I could do. This is a thing in Philadelphia. Yes, sir. How many turns you got in? Uh, See, that's why I've been reading on y'all. This is my second. I've been, I've been a constable for nine years. Yeah. So I know they got like a six term yes, in a certain area and then they roll out. Yeah. And just, you know what I'm saying? So, but, so what happened? Right. I had, I got a guy named Mr. Mike. He used to be a security guard. Y'all okay. my work. He was a security guard here. All he right. tried to tase me. Oh. I didn't steal nothing. I didn't do nothing wrong. Okay. All I was doing was charging my phone up. And as you can see now, if you look over there, yeah, yeah. the thing is plugged up where you can't charge it. Right. My work again. Okay. So on that day, I was charging my phone up. I had groceries. I seen somebody in the parking lot. I know. My groceries, you see the pole yeah. with a red sign at the camera? My groceries right there, but inside on the parking lot. Mr. Mike. Hold on. My grocery was over here. Some people I knew in the car. Yeah. So my phone was dying. I was recording them like now. So I shoot over here to the thing to charge it up. Yeah. The whole time it was plugged in, it was never charging. Okay. So it wasn't no need of charging it. So I'm taking the charge it out, taking the stuff. Right. Here come Mike come running in. Now the thing did not go off of nothing. I walked in through the wrong door. Right. I did everything different. Here come Mr. Mike running in. And when he ran in, he pulled out his taser. So I said, well, what you doing all that for? Right. And I was with my girl at the same time. Okay. So I didn't do nothing wrong. He came and pulled the taser out on me. Right. So I said, Mr. Mike, a security guard, not not a constable, a security yeah. guard. Yeah. Why are you pulling the taser out on me? Now, you see checkers? You see churches? Yeah. It was a guy that worked in churches. Uh -huh. He just happened to be over here with Mr. Mike. I yeah. guess they was friends. Well, I had the guy that worked in churches. He pulled out a pipe on me. Yeah, you know how they got the uh, the, the, the Temple Times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, he put like one of them metal joints out, right? Yeah. And at the time, I had eagle slippers on. Right. The guy that worked at churches was over here chilling with Mike, pulled the baton thing out on me. Yeah. Mike pulled the taser out on me. But let me just back it up a little bit. Right. When Mike came in, pulled the taser out, the guy that worked at churches, he was the mediator. He was trying to calm it down. Right. He, he was trying to make sure I didn't get hurt. Right. Then all of a sudden, it flipped. Now he pulled out the baton. He pulled out the taser. Look, I make it out the store. And you go get your groceries? Nope. They came and stole my groceries. Thank you, sir. Okay. They came and took my I took they, they came and took They came and took my groceries. Hey sir. That's what's up. That's what's up. That's what's up. So that's what they did. Oh, the cart right there. They stole my groceries and took it in there. Now, when I seen the cops, I reported it. That was robbery. They stole my stuff. And that's true. So here's here's my question. So did you call? Did you call uh, Walgreens corporate? No. Don't oh, nobody help me. So, I need to know. So you can easily go online All right. and, and, and get the Walgreens corporate number and you can find out the district number and you can just look at it. I got you, Walgreens 1607. You know what I'm saying? And then All just right. tell them which street and go from there. But let me let me just bring you in how the court uh, how the how the council book came in. Okay. So after Mr. Mike, they had another guard. Yeah. We had the same confrontation because now I want to know what to do about Mike. Yeah. Next thing you know, that guard wasn't here, yeah. the next guard, and then I seen the council book. So this is how me and the boy here tall white <laughs> constable with the Mercedes Benz souped up got into it. You ready? 
Now look, now from here at the next corner is a cop named Mr. Ortiz sitting on the corner right there. Mr. Ortiz, Mr. Rodriguez had a call about a thief. You ready? Okay. At the same time, I made a call at the foot podiatrist around there, right? So you got two calls as I re as I as I think it out now. You had two calls. Yeah. You ready? But why they came to my foot podiatrist first? Mr. Rock Tigas and Mr. Ortiz came to the foot podiatrist because I called the cops. I needed the foot podiatrist on my uh, the police for the foot podiatrist. I called the cops. You ready? And I'm, I'm, I'm done. Yeah. The cops came. They didn't do nothing but went in the building. I'm telling them, I'm called. I want my report. They said, hold on. And when we come out, guess who they saw? My friend, the thief. The thief had three canes he stole from Walgreens. So when they seen the thief, instead of doing my situation because they came to the job first, they went straight to the thief, brought the thief to Walgreens. Now, I got a cane. I said, Dad, I need a cane. He had three canes. The three canes was going. I said, oh, they're going back to Walgreens. So I walked back around here. And they brought the thief around here. I said, can I get my report now, Mr. Ortiz and Mr. Rodriguez? Right. Y'all seen me first before the thief. That's right. So and that's when the tall cancel with the ball head came out, forced me off, and I fell and hurt my side. Okay. Ever so, since that so day. What's your name again, boy? My name is Walter McNeil, sir. TC. Nice to meet so you, listen, Mr. TC. Here's what I'm How say. freak doing? He all right? <laughs> they got to know him, cancel boy. His name is Freak. He's <laughs> <laughs> Told you. So anyway, told anyway. you. So here's what I'm saying. Listen, bro, I'm not on that type of time. So no, you, you, you see me try to talk to the right, cops? So and down, what the cops do, run? I, I see you, <laughs> I said, let me go holler at my Cause man. Because I seen you. I said, yeah. I ain't got no beef with him. Let me go yeah. talk to the cops. Said, let me go holler at my man. And the only reason why I do that, man, because I'm just trying to show people, like, I'm not on that type of time. No, nah, you all right, sir. You all right. I, I like to talk to the people. I try to be friendly. I, no, you all right. I seen you with the kids. So I just wanted to make sure. Who do you report stuff to? If if you try to report stuff to the cops and they don't do their job. He already right. seen it. Didn't you, you see him? <laughs> and you go to um, inter attorney it's all affairs. Fair. And yeah. they don't do their nope. job. Nope. So I got to get a lawyer so then. What you can do, what you can do, I mean, you can For do the that, cops. Or what you can do is you can go to the, the local magistrate office. I knew it. Oh, like right knew up here where we at. And on okay. cops, we be seeing on the news. No, not yeah. the cops. The, the commissioners the and them. People. And then, yeah, the council people too. And okay. And on top of that, what you also can do is I tell everybody, look, if you have a problem, just call the corporate office, and then the corporate office and will handle it. That's what I keep trying to tell you. All right. So, so go online for corporate? Yeah, that's it. All you got to do All right. is, is, is be on here, yeah, it should be on. You can call the number, and then they'll give you the corporate number. I appreciate you. Yes, sir. Because listen, my thing is this. I want to watch your sir. I want everybody to feel... I want everybody to feel safe. And, 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 and check the dumb in. stuff out. Sure. They're going to ban me and tell me I can't come on their property because I kept come, kept doing this, doing this, yeah. until I got some type of result. Yeah. But now, since I can't come on the property, how about I still get medication there? Yeah. And see, and now that's it. Now that's and and she get my medication and stuff. But now, not to have no problems, I even switch. I don't even get my medication here now. Yeah. See I mean, how bad I got? See, my thing is this. Like I said, when I tell people. You smoke? No, no, sir. All right. When I catch them stealing. I'm not, my, my first action is not to put handcuffs or hands on them. I'm no, like, put handcuffs on these niggas. I'm going to tell you why. Okay. Because, yo, you know. Here you go. Walgreens was Watch this. Oh, I know. Watch this. Here you go, sir. I know. We got to go all the way out of our way oh, to go get stuff from the store. But see, yeah, but see my, my thing is, my thing is this. I, I thought she was going. I thought she was going. I thought she was going to tell you this. They see them all still and don't do nothing. And when I come in there, I don't still and do do nothing. Got harassed and all that. So I ain't see a person get locked up. And then when I see the cops up here and talk to them, they they do what they just did. It's like this, man. But no, you you are you are a person and you got a job to do. So you know, I respect the authority as far as what you're doing. Because I'm I'm looking like this, man. Like especially where I'm from, like. They're not processing retail no more. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. And so Unless you put the struggle up to, and then it become robbery. Because you, you see how long I had to do yeah. 20 years in and out to learn that crap? Yeah. Just for stealing petty stuff. That's and when saying. the guard grab you and you tussle and pull, now, now, it's, now it's a robbery. And, then yeah, if you, robbery. and if you do that, and yep. then it turns into something else. So me, I'm just like, look, you got something in your pocket. Ma'am, can, can I take it out? Can I have a detergent back, please? Don't try to uh, disrespect me. You want to disrespect me now? Because I know you got it. I ain't going to hold you. You know what it be? Because you caught me now. Right. Now the pride come in. Because right. now you being nice. Look, just give it to me. That's it. And then I'm like, 
And he caught me. He told me I didn't give it to him. Oh, man, he can't touch me. Let me walk away until he grabbed me. No, you are. Respect gets respect. I feel warm now, Mr. TC. That's it. My thing is this. If you ever come up here and you see me here, bro, you need something, I'll take care of you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Because that's what we do for our people. No, you're a real man. They don't do their job. Listen, my thing is this. I'm here for a Mr. T. Hey, Mr. T. I done seen him. I done seen him. The guy ran to the cops. Oh, God. The guy ran to the cops so the big guy wouldn't be aggressive, won't mess with him. The cop ain't do nothing. That guy was hitting him, hitting him, hitting him. I was rolling like, yo, you ain't going to do nothing. Yeah, I, I listen. I don't, I, look, they, as long as I do my job. Do yes, sir. I try, to, I try to mitigate, and that's it. I can't speak on nothing else because I'm not up here, and I'm not from here. I told you. He made me get in my bag. I had to do some homework. They ain't even supposed to have no council bulls in Philly. And the reason why you see them, ain't nobody never challenged it. Oh, no. Go, go ahead. That's what I read. Y'all all over. So hold on. But Philadelphia. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. To, to, to contradict what. Whatever, yes, sir. Because if you on live. No, I ain't on live. Okay. in my camera. In my camera. <laughs> in my camera. But no, the thing about it is, we, we, are, we are commissioned throughout the whole state of Pennsylvania. And so if we, if we um, gain a contract, right. we, it's peacekeeping. Okay. And, and that's what it is. All right. So, so it's are y'all in the worst location? Yes. Right. We figured that. Yeah. No, no, no. She told y'all them because I, I, I said it's contradiction. I said I ain't never ever ever see y'all. And she said, "Baby, you seen them down K and A?" I said, "Yeah, you right. I'm we talking about before K and A." All the worst ones, man. And, and it's like, honestly, I want people to be like, "Yo, I'm glad that they're here." Yeah, because, I'm, I am glad that y'all here. Exactly. I ain't gonna lie. I'm glad you here. Yeah. You ain't hurt nobody. Ain't nobody doing no stupid stuff on your watch. That's it. But hey, the other ones, they 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 man, they they turn an eye and, and and I ain't gonna hold you. Let me be a dope hair and white. Told you. No, 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 not you. Okay. I'm talking about before you. Let me with a dope hair and white. We done seen dope hairs come out with taller paper. I tell you, they, they take the whole. That's right. Good job. Yeah, yeah, where, where the other dog at? You had two. <laughs> this is the old dog. I thought you had two dogs. Oh, I know I went crazy. Uh, here we go. All right, OJ. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's my neighbor. I used to live across the street from him. What's up, yay? <laughs> my wife said she seen you the other day. You ain't had no words. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you gotta get a drink in him. <laughs>